back everyone for some more of my Super Mario Maker 2 Hot Courses series, and I will be playing as Luigi in this video, and we'll try to get through as many Hot Courses as we can. I'm going to try to make this about a 20 minute long video if I can, but more importantly, hope you guys have an awesome Sunday, hope you guys are doing well. And this will be the last Mario uh, Maker 2 level that I'll be making up until I finish Story Mode in Kirby in the Forgotten Land because I really do need to finish that game here soon, but, um, well, at least the Story Mode mo uh, portion of it, but, uh, this will be returning soon enough, so I hope you guys are looking forward to that and hope you guys don't miss this too much before now and then, but, but without further ado, let's try out this Japanese level with a theme technical stage. Oh, come on! Good thing there are infinite fire flowers. Oh, come on! Did I want cat suit or did I... I, I don't know if that was the right decision. Take this. Checkpoint. Thanks for giving me a fighting chance level. Of course, he's going to be in invincibility mode for God knows how long. Okay, that was kind of a mess. I was gonna say, please don't tell me I have to fight him again. I actually didn't mind that one, so I'm gonna give that one a like. Something that was a rarity in yesterday's video. Okay, let's show this one. It's an Auto Mario stage. It has 90 in the description. I'm not sure what that's referring to, but we're gonna try it. Okay, I'm trusting this. I'm not touching anything. This better be Auto Mario. And that was Auto Mario, it did not deceive me or anything, so that's good. I'm not gonna hurt it, but I do appreciate that the tag stayed true to what it was, but um... Let's show this stage, it's a short and sweet single player stage, I can't read any of that unfortunately. There we go. Very weird stage. OK, 
Okay, let's see what we have next. Let's try this one. It, it says L-L-L-L-M-M-N. It's a standard music stage. I can't read the description. It has a clear condition, which is kind of interesting. Reach the goal as Cat Mario. Let me just see something for a second. Sorry about that. Oh! But yeah, we're supposed to reach the goal as Cat Mario. Get taking damage from there. Oh, come on. After all of that. After all of that, and that's how I take damage? Are you kidding me with that? There we go. And of course, that was the end. Okay, let's try this level. It's 1-1. Uh, it's an auto Mario, Mario stage. It's Japanese level. Description says 1-1. Well, let's see how auto Mario this is. That that thumbnail looks like a mess. Reach the goal while riding Yoshi. Well, right away this level was a lie because this is not auto Mario. Yeah, this is not Auto Mario. Not in the slightest. I should just do, do uh, well. It's actually not the creator's fault how this is tagged, so I'm, I'm not gonna boo it, but I'm certainly not gonna hurt it either. Let's try this Japanese level, it's in a Mario Brothers 3 style, which automatically makes me happy. Hopefully it's a good level. That was, uh, that was over way too quick. Let's try this Japanese level. I know I've, I've been playing a lot of Japanese levels, but I'm going to try to play from other nationalities if I can. Okay. Well, that happened. Let's try this level, it's by Legend007 from Canada, and this is Ocarina of Time Inside the Deku Tree. It's a puzzle-solving theme stage, and it's Temple Number 1. I've not played Ocarina of Time, so... I don't, really don't know what to expect here.
Okay. Nice. Is that all that was in this part? I'm supposed to do. I almost timed that relatively poorly. I meant to grab onto that vine. Okay, now we'll go up to the boss. Hey there, Cherish. I like that stage, so I'm gonna give that one a heart. I'm glad I played it. Good job, Legend 007. Oh, I gotta play this one. This is by Judah F. from the U.S. and this is Skalumba Castle, which is a Mario Brothers 3 Sky format, which I'm automatically happy about that. It's a standard theme stage with no description. Now, depending on how long it takes for me to beat this stage, it might be my final one of the video. I don't know yet. No! I got a boot. Not too happy I lost my mushroom, but at least I got a boot. And I don't have just any boot, I have a boot with wings. I could see this benefiting me, as long as I don't lose it. Uh, I only need another... I need another key somewhere. Thank you. 
just gotta be real careful here. Okay, I lost my boots. It's just a bonus room. Nice, I get my wing boot back. Whoa! Kinda want stiletto. There we go! And I think I have time to play one more stage. But it has to be a short one. But yeah, I like that stage a lot. Let's see. Let's end things off with a snow level here. It's in a 3D world style. It's a Japanese themed single player stage. Well, okay. I don't know, I'm I'm guessing this is Auto Mario. There we go. I got kind of flung through a loop there. I wasn't quite sure what to expect there. Well, go ahead and exit that. And I think that is where I'm going to call it. Like the old saying goes, I'm going to quit while I'm ahead. So, but yeah, these levels were so much better than the levels I played yesterday. Like I said on yesterday's video, I'm not even sure how many more times I'm going to play new courses because the last few episodes, I just they just weren't fun to play. I don't, not sure if I'm just picking the wrong times to play new courses, but it just seems like not many of them at all are even worth playing. But at least with hot courses, at least some of them are playable and some of them actually ended up being quite good as this video shows, so, uh, Leave me a comment below if you want, if you played any of these levels, what you think about them. But, um, thank you guys so much for watching this. Hope you guys are enjoying the series so far. I'll be seeing you guys again next time.